Yeah, hi, I'm Thomas Schmidt from uh, the University of Applied Sciences in Hamburg. I'm a professor of computer networks there, working in, uh, in the field of internet technologies, mobility and uh, related stuff in group communication. Great, how long have you been involved with the IETF and what areas are you interested in here? Well, my involvement started about 10 years ago on the mailing list and my first meeting in the IETF was actually here in Paris uh, in 2005. Um, and I've been, I've started to get involved in the Internet Research uh, Task Force in, in, in a research group on mobility at that time, which was a hot topic in the, in the early 2000s. And we started to, um, to contribute ideas and, um, and then met uh, people here and then the thing progressed. Out of our research work, uh, um, an IETF group was created and uh, since then I'm involved in this IETF group which is called Multimob. But we are, we are also uh, involved in other groups now by, uh, uh, regarding ZIP, peer-to-peer uh, -peer ZIP and uh, routing. CIDA uh, and, and other, other areas. Wow, that's great. So uh, what, what value do you find out of IETF? How does it help you in what you're doing at, as in your university? Well, the, the key value I consider in, uh, in IETF and IRTF is the very open discussion, the very open discourse on ideas, arguments, uh, close exchange, and also the meeting and the discussion with the, with the relevant people. Uh, here in IETF, IRTF, you meet basically everyone who, who met us in the in the area you are working in, provided you are in internet tech, you are in internet technologies. Um, the other big value I consider is uh, relevance in in the practical field. So it, this is not a pure academic work, but it uh, has the has the at least the perspective of deployment, and you you discuss with people who could potentially deploy your solutions operators, uh, ISPs, uh, application companies, uh, and uh, that's of great value. It doesn't, doesn't make much sense from my point of view to, to build academic protocols that nobody even notices of and nobody will ever implement or deploy.